Don't forget, 7.30 tonight in front of the grandstand is the True Value Country Showdown, which opens for Lori Morgan, who is the headline entertainer tonight. Also, all kinds of things going on at the fair this evening. The Extreme Air Thrill Show, an ice carving demonstration. Don't forget the Frog Jumping Championships at the Free Entertainment Area at 7 o'clock. A lot of attractions at the Decoin State Fair. Take time to visit. Tenth race is on the track. This will wrap up the harness racing today. Win, play, show, exact, a trifecta wagering. Non-winners of two pair mutual races or $5,000 life for these pacers. Number one, Road Haas is scratched. Two is AP Program, owned by Kathleen Chick Keebler of Aldemont. She's the trainer. Tom Simmons, the driver. Three is Tattler's Tail, owned by Stenback Stables of Pittsfield, trained by Mike Rogers, Eric Ledford in the bike. Number four, Riff, owned, trained by Tom Graham Jr. of Salem, but driven by Dale Heitman. Number five is OG Sweet Sweet, owned by Carl Ogle Jr. of Paris, trained and driven by Charles Allen Finn. Number six, Jack-O-Lantern, is owned by David Snyder, Beulah Kemp, Charles Helene, and Mark Kingery of Martinsville and Heron, Illinois, trained by Snyder, the driver, Randall Finn. Number seven, BR Leader, owned by Gene Millville from Heron DuCoin, trained and driven by Ray Gash. Number eight, Mac Only Time, is owned by Tom and Mary Alice Tietrick. And by their sons, T and Tim. They are from Jeff, Illinois. T, T Trick trains. Tim, T Trick drives. Nine, Exceed Demand, owned by Jeff Sanders of Cordova, Tennessee, trained and driven by Ronnie Guy. And Master Fox is number 10, owned by H. Phil Pierce of Carmine, and Buddy and Clay Simpson of Fairfield, trained by Buddy Simpson, and he is the driver. This trifecta race to close things out today is three minutes from post. Here they come. They're off and pacing. Exceed Demand and BR Leader are out very quickly. BR Leader gets over toward the rail. Exceed Demand is there on the outside as they move in to the first turn. Jack-O-Lantern comes away in third. Up front, there goes Exceed Demand now. He gets clear for the lead by three lengths, going to the quarter-mile mark. BR Leader is second by three. Mac Only Time moves up into the third position and is followed by Master Fox, who's fourth on the outside of Jack-O-Lantern in fifth. AP Program is sixth. OG Sweet Sweet is seventh. 27 seconds, a quick front quarter for this overnight race. They head on to the back stretch. Riff is next to last, and Tattler's tail is last, 25 lengths off the lead. Exceed Demand has the lead by some three lengths to BR Leader, who's second by two. Mac Only Time goes third by three to Master Fox, a gap of three more, back to Jack O'Lantern, then AP Program, another eight lengths to OG Sweet Sweet, followed by Riff on the outside, and Tattler's tail is trailing at the half mile mark in 56 and one. There goes BR Leader out of second, up to challenge exceed demand. Mac only time is stalking them in third. Master Fox is fourth. Jack-O-Lantern comes off the rail in fifth. He's four lengths off the lead. Five more back to AP program, then Riff, OG Sweet Sweet, and Tattler's Tail. BR Leader, midway on the turn, puts a neck in front. Exceed demand is second. Here comes Mac only time. Mac only time is three wide now and moves up to join the leaders. He goes to second as Jack O'Lantern is trying to move into contention behind him. He's now third. Master Fox is fourth. Off the three quarters in 126 and four. Mac only time gets the lead. BR Leader is second, coming to the eighth pole. Then Jack O'Lantern is third. Master Fox is fourth. Jack O'Lantern to the center of the racetrack. Mac only time needs to find more. Riff from far back. And BR Leader toward the inside has been very game. Now Jack O' Lantern to the lead. BR Leader second. Riff is still coming on the outside. Jack O' Lantern. Riff is running out of time. Here's the line. Jack O' Lantern hanging on to win it by three parts of a length. Riff was second. BR Leader was third. And the time was one minute 58 and three fifths seconds. We were just a bit tired coming down the stretch, weren't we? Photo for the win. Hold all tickets. Before we neglect to do so as we leave. Kristen Clark, thank you to her for serving as our ring mistress today. She's in the winner's circle in victory lane along with the winning connections for race 10. Here's number six, Jack-O-Lantern, Randall Finn with the winning drive. Number six, Jack-O-Lantern finishing first in the photo. The four, Riff was second. The seven, BR Leader third. The 10, Master Fox was fourth. Jack-O-Lantern, a three-year-old gelded son of Cole Muffler, second winner of the day for trainer Dave Snyder, who also bred this winner. Second winner of the day as owner for Snyder and for co-owner, Charles Halini and Mark Kingery and Beulah Kemp also owns part of this three-year-old pacer as well. Third win of the year for Jack O'Lantern and a new lifetime record, 158 and three. It is official, the 6-4 exacta, $73.60. The trifecta and the rundown are coming up.